A popular local brewery looking to tap into a new part of the Central Coast is seeing its plans come up dry. KCOY 12's Dave Alley is live in Santa Maria to update us on the unexpected opposition the brewing company has been facing since moving into the city. Dave? Uh, hi, Melissa. Uh, you may recall a few weeks ago, we told you about Libertine Brewing Company and its expansion into Santa Maria, into the building behind me. But soon after they moved in, they faced opposition to a very key part of their business plan. Now, earlier this week, the city's planning commission made a decision on the disputed part of that project, and it wasn't good news for Libertine. A plan to open a tasting room by Libertine Brewing Company has gone flat. We were uh, denied our uh, tasting room uh, addition to our production facility here in uh, Santa Maria. The San Luis Obispo County-based company moved into Santa Maria recently, hoping to expand its operation. Instead, it was met with resistance. It's a, basically a bar and I, it's going to probably force me to sell my build, building. Business owner James Sims opposes the tasting room so much he created a petition against it, voicing numerous concerns, particularly space and occupancy. What about the people who come? Are they going to turn them away, send them away? How do, where, do you, where do you park them? Co-owner Tyler Clark tried to alleviate those worries during a meeting last week with other neighbors. I felt like it was really positive. Everybody seemed upbeat, excited. We had a sign-in sheet, and everybody wrote uh, either neutral or supportive on there. Clark emphasizes a tasting room is vital to his business. And just down the street, Santa Maria Brewing recently opened up its own tasting room and reports no problems. None whatsoever. It's a very low-key Come in, enjoy some of our product, sample it, decide what you like, take some with you. Now that the tasting room has been denied by the planning commission, it doesn't mean the fight is over just yet. Libertine has the opportunity to make a final appeal to the city council. Turn in our paperwork um, early next week, um, and then we'll get a we'll get a city council meeting date, and uh, hopefully we can get a good turnout for a local community that is supporting us, and um, we can uh, hopefully change their minds. Now, the city council ultimately votes against the tasting room. Clark tells me he isn't sure what the company will do with the building behind me since direct sales to customers and customer interaction is so vital to their business. As for Sims, he told me today that there are no winners in this process, and he wishes Libertine the best of luck. Reporting live in Santa Maria, Dave Alley, KCOY 12, Central Coast News.